Okie dokie, so it's my turn to make this video now, or make this post or whatever. A few people have had this recently, but my intake pipe has split, so now it's time to go and put a new one on, and here it is. It's a genuine Suzuki part. Um, a link will be in the description as to where you can buy this from if, you, um, if you're having this problem yourself. Um, let's switch to the GoPro, and I will show you just how to put it on. All right, so you can probably see now, actually, Never mind, it stops as soon as I actually point that out. But you could see or hear probably then whilst I was waffling on um, that it was hunting a little bit. And I feel like this is what's also causing that problem. And I feel like a bit of a dummy now that I've um, found this out after all this time because it's actually been doing this for like two years. And I swear to God, if this pipe has been cracked for two years, I'm going to be so annoyed with myself. It's probably the case, I'm not going to lie, but yeah, we're going to have to gloss over that because I'm such a dummy for that. Let's go and get it fixed. A couple of things I would like to mention first before we get to the unit though. You will notice that I started doing some stickers of the Walls Workshop logo, the new one that I've put on the channel. Um, we've actually sold a few of those already, so big shout out to yourselves if you bought one, you know who you are. Um, big up yourself for supporting, it actually means a hell of a lot and it just gives me ideas of what I can do with the channel in the future. It all makes it a better experience for you, so thanks for that, you're a legend. So I've got another idea with stickers as well. Um, it's the same size and style as the Walls Workshop logo ones, but instead of it being the Walls Workshop logo, I was thinking of having the Suzuki Sport logo or something like that. I've got loads of different colours. I'll put them on the screen now. I've made like all this stuff just to see what you think. I reckon it'll be a pretty good idea because I know there's a lot of different wacky colours that people have on their sports and non-sports as well. I've seen it all over Instagram and Facebook and what have you. I'm in all the groups. As you probably know, you've probably seen me. Um, but yeah, let me know what you think about that because I think that'd be a pretty cool idea. And those wondering about pricing, they're going to be priced very reasonably at the same price as what the Walls Workshop logo stickers are priced at. So yeah, let me know what you think about that or any other merch ideas or anything you've got that you think um, that you'd like to see on the merch store. Let me know because I'm always looking for different ideas to get working on because I'm eager to get this stuff going. But anyway, back to the main topic of the video. Let's get this intake pipe on. And there we have it. You can see there, it has cracked all the way through completely. So there's our so there's our answer to what is probably a two-year problem. Whew, happy days. Look at that. It's pretty much all the way through. Here's a final look at the old one. You can see it was starting to go here as well, all along there, as well as all along here. And then check this out where the little feed line goes in. The whole thing is cracked. So this thing is absolutely toast. So let's get the new one. This is absolutely miles better. Right, so a bit of a huff and puff that was, it's back on and now we just need to slap this bit back on which is going to be changing very soon but I'm going to make a separate video about it but yeah, that there is roughly how you uh, how you redo that I've used the uh, same Jubilees, just be careful of um, this here, it can get a bit tight and as you've just seen there with me trying to wrestle this back on it gets a bit tight there but it's back on and hopefully it's eliminated our problem so I'll put that back on and we'll give it a test and now for the moment of truth It's not doing it. Might do a bit because it's cold, so we'll give it a minute. Let me take this off my head so you can see this, but I think that gives a pretty uh, a pretty accurate verdict after just about 30 seconds there. It's fixed the issue that I've had for so, so long, and I can't quite believe it. I can't remember what this car sounded like when it idles normally, but it's good to see it again, obviously. So there you have it. Yeah, there you have it. That is how you fix your hunting issues on a ZC32S and replace the cracked 
little intake pipe here. I hope you enjoyed and I hope this uh, helps you out. Thanks again for watching and I'll catch you again shortly.